My co-founders and I, when we met, we established this vision for Emerge, which is we believe in a future where distance and time don't stand in the way of feeling present. If you think about how we communicate and understand our own emotions today and, and transmit that to someone else, it's really limiting and linear. I'm a husband, I'm a father, uh, uh, my kid was in Ecuador, and I was missing first steps, I was missing his first words. You're calling over a cell phone, you're calling over a video call, and it still seems so distant. Sometimes we say that physical distance becomes emotional distance. I've been an immigrant my whole life, so the people that I really care about, my family and friends, my parents are miles away, and we don't have a good platform today to communicate with them. I met my co-founders Sly and Mauricio at Singularity University. Came together as a team because we had the same vision and the same passion about human communication. If I want to explain to my family members, it's like virtual teleportation. Connecting people who are separated by distance. Imagine you can have like a virtual handshake. Our first uh, proof of concept that allowed you to communicate touch over distance. Once we achieved that, we started combing the space to understanding which technologies we could leverage to solve for. Always thinking of presence and what that meant. So we're working with cutting edge technology that allow you to touch objects that are, that are digital, that are uh, part of a immersive experience. Yes, not only can we enable you to physically touch and feel XR immersive content with your bare hands, not a wearable or a glove, we can allow you to share that object with someone else on the other side of the world today. I also teach um, at USC's film school, and I know that touch has been known to improve cognition and retention of information. So if we can bring touch to those environments, I think it'd be really exciting. Our goal here at Emerge is not to replicate how reality feels. We want to create a new language for the virtual world. The fact that our communications today allow us to use just two senses, sight and sound, we think is not enough. We believe it's now time to add a new dimension into our communications.